So it's now time to work on the main body and associated elements, including our cool little AN replica fittings. If you've never seen AN fittings before, they are used in tricked out cars a lot to support high pressure systems like nitrous oxide. So it took more than a few days to model these and work through half a dozen iterations more to get all the components to work together. The biggest challenge was most obviously that all of these have interconnected threads in all of the parts. Also on the front of the body, it contains a human detection system. This is a millimeter wave PCB that can detect humans in a room. We'll also be using some simple gesture control as the on off switch for the robot model. So now we need to get all our insert embedded nuts added in and I'll do a first pass on cleaning up some of the parts while I'm at it. Okay, so we finally are getting the dry fit all together. All of the parts are coming together really precisely. And now like every other stage, we need to sand and prep for paint with a round of filler primer. I'm going to do all the upper head AN fittings at the same time as there's a ton of sanding to get these parts perfect. Alright, so up next we'll cover off just how hard it has been to design and build human scale eyes. So make sure you like and subscribe to get the next update and if you think this project pretty cool, sharing it on other social media will really help support and grow the channel as well. Alright, till next time, take care.